further grab the weather cooperated uh, today and the weather will continue to cooperate for the rest of our holiday weekend. No weather worries there and no weather worries tropically, but we do have a very close eye on Hurricane Larry, the very strong, powerful, major hurricane way out in the Atlantic, still a couple thousand miles away from us. There also is another area of some potential development down in the Gulf of Mexico over the next couple days or so. May just be some more rain for parts of the deep south and the Florida panhandle. Uh, we'll keep an eye on that one, but uh, Larry is the one that will be impacting the east coast in the way of surf and the way of waves and the way of rip currents. Uh, pretty much um, early next week throughout the week, there's going to be a, a big swell building from this thing because you've had a, a, a long Long-lived, strong hurricane, that builds the wind, the wind builds the swell, the swell travels a really long way, and that means it's stronger and has a little bit more energy. So careful along the beaches uh, this week and into uh, next weekend. Good. Uh, look at the eye on this thing. It's super, super fascinating here. Uh, kind of a textbook picture of a major hurricane. If you open up a meteorology textbook, you turn to major hurricane, you probably see a satellite imagery uh, like that. Now, the latest track from the National Hurricane Center has a bit more of a nor northerly turn. That's good. We want that for sure, and we want this thing to stay out to sea, and they're all, it is all intentions that it will. There are a few factors we're looking at, and it should stay east of Bermuda, but there will be impacts to Bermuda likely between Wednesday and Thursday of the week coming up. This should be passing by us by about five to 600 miles later on in the week, Thursday or Friday. Two things we're watching for in uh, our tropical cyclones kind of path in this setup. The smaller this area of high pressure, the tighter the turn, the more east of Bermuda it'll be. The bigger this area of high pressure is, that's kind of like a mountain. I can't really go towards that. The bigger the area of high pressure is, the wider that turn will be. So those are the two things we're watching. The third, this week, later on in the week, there's going to be a cold front dropping in. That acts as kind of like a shield and will actually help kind of kick this out to sea. So we'll watch the timing and the strength of that front to see uh, how close it'll be interacting with Bermuda, how much it stays out to sea, how far it stays out to sea. And we are liking that and agreeing with all of those things. So the uh, confidence is growing in that. But of course, there is still uncertainty when it comes to the tropics. So I would just check back in, uh, say, by Tuesday or so. And we'll have a much better idea of what's going on. Now, this is not the front that's going to kick Larry out at sea, but this one is actually going to drop into us by Monday. No rain and nothing to ruin Labor Day's forecast, but may just throw a couple extra clouds around. Tonight, uh, it's mostly clear and it feels really nice outside. We're in the 60s pretty much for all of us. 65 in Chesapeake right now. 61 a husky. How about that? Nice little fresh feel to the air. It's going to stay that way. Mostly clear skies tonight. Dropped our low temperatures just a bit into the low 60s. Tomorrow's going to be another nice one, just a little bit warmer than today. And we will have a southwest breeze that gets going, and that's going to help, again, those temperatures up into the mid to upper 80s or so. The humidity values should st still stay low, so it won't be all that kind of sticky or muggy out there. Now, into Labor Day, here is that front we showed you on the satellite and radar. Not much rain associated with it. Maybe just a couple clouds around later on Monday. So Labor Day's forecast still looks really good. Should start in the 70s. High should be in the mid 80s. Generally dry. Maybe just a stray shower or two. That would be by the afternoon and the evening. Then it looked good through Tuesday. Then this is the front we're watching, which will help kick Larry out to sea. That's going to give us a better shot at rain Wednesday into Thursday. We're into the 70s. 